Next up, Crystal Mountain announced last month an extension to the ski and ride season for bonus weekends through April 28th. For bonus weekends, skiing and riding will only be available Fridays through Sundays, but hey, who doesn't love some extra skiing on the slopes, right? So joining us to continue the conversation this morning is Emma Bryce, the marketing project manager for Crystal Mountain. Emma, nice to have you with us this morning. Yeah, thank you for having me. Good to see you. So talk with us about this extended ski season and what's being offered and how it's how it's going so far. Yeah, so we, we're we uh, open through April 28th, as you said. We typically close for daily operations mid-April, so our last day of seven days a week will be April 14th, and then we're continuing with two more bonus weekends um, with lots of fun events. We have our Verde Valley Bank Slalom kicking it off, and then we'll have our over-the-top rail jam the, the last weekend to close out the, the spring skiing. Some cool events. So we saw some late snowfall this year. So how was the season going before recent snowfall in March? So yeah, this season has been um, a hard one to predict. We're in an El Nino, so uh, definitely lower than average snowfall. As of February 15th, we were at 72% of our snowpack. And then we got hit with some big storms that actually pushed us into our um, normal range. So right now we're sitting at a total snowfall of 278, 278 inches. Um, typically we see around 350. So we're still a little under um, normal, but we definitely made some ground with some recent snowfall. I was going to say you guys got some snow recently, right? Yeah, yeah, we've see, received um, a few inches the last few days, and then it's expected through through the weekend as well. All right, I know that we're still in the midst of this season, uh, but we have to know, is there anything that's already getting planned for next ski season? Yeah, we, we always are planning ahead. We have our event lineup kind of in the works, and then we have, um, we're back on the unlimited icon pass. So if you buy your 2425 icon pass now, you can ski through this current season um, and then you get full summer access as well. That's the biggest change that we're seeing for next season. And then um, also, you know, planning with lots of lots of new improvements to the terrain and resort. And um, we're excited to, to announce those as we get more details. Yeah, good to know. We look forward to hearing. So when people think of Crystal Mountain, they think of snow activities primarily, but what about the summer and fall? Are there activities people can do up at Crystal? Absolutely. Summer is um, full of events as well. We have live music every weekend. We do our Farm to Mountain dinner series at the Summit House, which is the state's highest elevation restaurant. Um, so people can come up, take the gondola, and then we do a very you know, gourmet specialized um, dinner series every every weekend. And then we also host weddings. There's lots of hiking, wildflower viewing. And then um, this summer we're introducing a climbing wall at the base area to accompany our new adventure ropes course. So lots to do in the summer, definitely come check it out. Um, and then the proximity to Mount Rainier National Park is really special as well. It's just amazing. Yeah, so much fun to have. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks so much, Emma, for joining. Yeah, thank you. Oh, Farm to Mountain. Mm -hmm. Something I can get behind. I have to say that's one of my favorite spots when I was doing a little bit more reporting, being sent up to Crystal Mountain when you have the time to go up there. It's just the views are breathtaking. Mm -hmm. I remember a couple of years ago, I got sent down to Crystal to um, report on the snow, and we took the, the gondola up a ways, and we were up shooting some video and looking at the beautiful landscape up there, and we actually saw one of those proposals. Like there was a guy Aww. that just a few feet away, away from us just dropped down on his knee and proposed to his girlfriend That's and so they sweet. talked to us and I was like, this is amazing. <laughs> uh, and the view behind him is just spectacular. Wow, I'm sure that made for some pretty photos and, oh, and yes. a good report. <laughs> That's right. That's right.